Inflation driving up the price of gifts. You may be turning to resale sites like Facebook Marketplace, OfferUp, and Craigslist. But buyer beware, a Raleigh woman reached out to WREL after she was swindled out of hundreds of dollars. Five Hundred Sides' Keely Arthur has some simple steps you can take to avoid this yourself. Hey, so sweet. Single parent Natalie Lee is set on giving her son the very best Christmas possible. Like the first time that they see Santa Claus, it's just you want to give that to them. And for a nine-year-old boy, getting the Meta Quest 2 VR headset definitely beats Santa. Anytime that they want something really bad, I, I try to find a way to make it happen. On top of her paycheck, Lee scraped together money by reselling her items online and came across the very VR headset over on offer up. But it's kind of like Facebook Marketplace. The device sells at stores for about three to four hundred dollars. Lee spotted it on offer up for two hundred and eighty. A good deal, or so she thought. I felt very comfortable because we were face to face and I did the transaction. She paid the seller through Cash App. During the exchange, she didn't look in the box because she felt it was heavy inside. Big mistake. Back in her car with the seller, or should we say scammer, long gone, she opened it and only found plastic and cardboard. My heart sank. I felt duped. I felt embarrassed. Um, I couldn't believe that I wouldn't think to look at the box. Why um, didn't you? That's such a great question. Because, I, I mean, I guess I wanted to trust, I wanted to trust that all people are good and that nobody would do something like that. Now, the Raleigh mom did what experts say you're supposed to do. She met at a public place, but I want you to take that a step farther and make the exchange in front of your local police department. You're going to be under the watchful eyes of officers. Plus, the bad guys and gals probably won't want to be anywhere near here. Now, if you ask them to come to one of our police stations and they say no, obviously something's wrong with that. Yeah. And when you get your package, make sure you open up the package and check it before you leave the transaction. Five on your side reached out to Cash App and they told us they couldn't help Lee and sent us to their customer support page. Similar service app though, Venmo offers payment protection. Simply click it before sending your payment. It'll cost the seller a few cents or dollars, but if you don't get what you paid for, you can get your money back. Something Lee wishes she had known about. Have you told your son what ha happened? I haven't told him that he's not getting it. That would break my heart to do that. Keely Arthur, five on your side. Boy, that's, that hurts. Lee filed a report with Raleigh Police and OfferUp is looking into the matter.